Greetings and welcome back Roboteers to Robocraft from scratch, the series in which I have been working through the very early game, experiencing the joys of playing with a new account and gradually unlocking all of the new uh, tech, and also seeing the creativity of other players in the low ranks. Now, it has been quite a while since I recorded any on this series. Robocraft has been going through a number of changes over the last couple of weeks, quite frantically changing so uh, I decided I'd just chill out and wait for things to settle and it kind of has even though there are fairly big changes on the on the table I do want to get back to the Robocraft from scratch series so we are going to be checking things out specifically let's go and have a look because quite a few things have changed since I started the uh, Robocraft from scratch series now let's have a look at what we have available to us we have mech legs starting at tier 8 that's next level we're gonna have access to those what else are we going to unlock at that time it looks like that's pretty much it oh no we'll actually unlock some of the first shields we'll unlock the uh mark ii shields as well that'll actually be pretty nice now these are the mark ii legs so we do actually have access to some mark one legs right there only 161 and a tiny little diddy caterpillar track as well oh how cute now i'm thinking that it would be <clears throat> a good idea to start as it's been a, a little while and i'm i'm not quite in the right mindset to continue with the hoplite at the moment uh hover smg oh sorry hover plasma at the moment so I think we're going to go with Robo 3 and we are going to dismantle this bot completely and in this episode start work on a mech bot. Um, I'll think about the name as we go. Now the first thing we're going to need are some mech legs obviously enough. Uh, we will take, we could make a quadruped, we could make a tri-legged bot possibly, um, or we could make just a walker, it uh, walks upright. Uh, we'll grab four, and we'll see what we can do with that. So there we go. There's our four mech legs. Now, how many cubes have we got? We don't have too many at the moment. We've got a couple of the Mark I armors. So, yeah, let's let's go ahead and build something. Now, as always, when you place a block down the bottom to rise it up, it's comma and full stop. Comma brings it down, full stop takes it up. And if you want to reposition it in the garage, it's the arrow keys. So, just the regular arrow keys, not wasid. Okay, so, the first and most important question here is, is it going to be walking upright? And if so, how do we want to position the legs? Are we going to make a roughly humanoid-shaped bot? I don't think so. I think what we're going to do is we're going to flesh out a sort of a blocky beginning something like this i'm thinking maybe something along the lines of battle tech max Well then, that's where we have to stop, unfortunately. The lights, I cannot fit another one, and thus 
I'm not sure that we want to do anything more. It is a fairly weak bot, all things told. It's actually got <laughs> a fairly high robo ranking considering what it is. Let's go ahead to the garage and we will have a quick look at, uh, let's see, no, we want to select robot. The Hoplite 1900, fairly well built bot. This 1200, not, not the best built bot, but uh, we're going to be rolling with it. Let's see. Um, oh, got caps up, countdown. Battletech. There we go. Right, so the Battletech leaves some things to be desired, to be fair. If I strip off these lights, I'm probably going to be able to do a lot more with it. Um, in fact, I'm kind of tempted to. There we go. We'll do that. Gives us a little bit of room. Possibly enough. Yes, there we go. Now, again, not the best <laughs> built bot ever. But, hopefully... It'll be able to hold its own. We'll have to see. Let's, uh, <laughs> it is basically a, a potato on legs with guns attached. But we'll see how this does in battle. We're just going to jump straight into a match now. Let's uh, go ahead, drive robot, and team deathmatch. We're not going to test it. Even though that's the capital sin, I actually feel that this bot needs to be trial by fire rather than... Uh, actually trying to work out whether it's going to work or not because of it. it certainly won't and that's going to be funny okay so where are my companions and what do they look like oh, wow you are basically a roll cage with hot blades okay i feel a little bit less bad about my potato with legs and guns and someone with uh, one of the very early starter bots i'm about to go to everyone good luck have fun everyone Wow, we actually move fairly quickly with this little thing. See how well we can jump. Uh, not too bad, actually. That little hover blade, though. Wow, it's gone far. I'm slow compared to my companions. So slow. Okay. Now, where are the enemy? Let's get you pinged. Let's try and take off your weapons if we can. You're the next one to go for. Seems our ally has been slain. There we go. Right, we need to engage a little bit more carefully because most of our team hasn't actually moved yet. Not sure what's up with that, honestly, but uh, I'm not a big fan of it, I'll be honest with you. Let's try and hit you. Oh, we got someone just over there. Hello! Let's go for... An actual kill here. Whilst moving backwards. Not doing particularly well. Let's try and split you off intelligently. Burst fire. Go in for the middle. Seeing if I can disconnect something important. There we go. And we won. My cockpit is no more. But I've still got all of my... Well, I've got all but one of my weapons. It's not too bad. We've lost one person on our team. The enemy have lost three. Where are the enemies, the question. Okay, I see you over there. See if I can't get a couple of shots in. There we go. Looks like one of my allies is also attacking. Should have them down fairly quickly. Fantastic. Okay, we've got another enemy just down there. Get all of my guns to bear without necessarily making myself completely open to their attack, which I more or less have. They are zero winning on me right now. There we go. And you as well. Fantastic. Okay, where are the enemy? We are currently cap capturing the enemy base. SMG. That is an enemy down there. Wasn't pinged, unfortunately. Let's see if we can uh, do a little bit of damage to them. Yeah, most of our allies are moving in right now. We should be good. Right now, the fact that my legs have shields make them the most healthy part of this bot. SMG because damage isn't applied directly to the health. Which is actually an interesting thing to consider. Drat. He's on the move. 
I don't think he's really going to pose much of a threat. But you up there, you've got a chunk of health still. See if we can't help fix that. I'm sure you don't want to be that healthy. Just makes you a target, honestly. Oh, no, 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 no. Walker legs, why? Oh, Walker legs, you have betrayed me. Oh, well. We won by capping the base. Uh, first place in score, but not by much. Three kills, one assist. Mr. Looms got four kills. Very nice indeed. Comparative damage there. Not a bad game. Most of our team in the upper there, but again, with the way that uh, you gain extra points for being on the winning team, that isn't too surprising. But there were a lot of people without any actual kills or assists, which is interesting. Um, a couple of people on our team did more or less nothing. Oh, actually, no, you did something. You did do a little bit of damage, but a lot of people did virtually nothing. That's quite interesting to see. Okay, is that going to be enough for a level? I'm not sure. But if it is, we'll have Mark two legs, which would be very nice. Very nice indeed. I don't think it was quite enough. Uh, we got 1,974 RP for that battle. We're right on top of our level. Uh, I think we've got enough time for one more. Maybe, yes, I think so. Okay, let's go ahead and jump straight into another team deathmatch and see how it goes. And Siri is cheering me on there from her cage right next to my computer. Okay, let's see how this goes. Right, what are my companions going to be like? We have got some little, ooh, someone with high armor and shields. Very interesting. Okay. Couple of walkers, some tanks. Very interesting indeed. Very interesting. Right, okay, well. Wow, you've got a. That is actually an interesting bipedal bot. I think we should probably move as a group. Necessarily moving down the middle is not the best way to go. Love that little bot there, though. Wow. That actually looks really, really nice. Okay, well, I guess everyone is going down the middle, so I will follow the rest of my team. Don't necessarily think this is the best way to go, but we'll see. They are literally going down the middle. Hello, little bot. We've got one enemy over there. Ah, oh, drat, I missed the ping. You gonna show yourself? Couldn't quite get you. I'll get you, though, as soon as I can. You taking fire? I think you probably are. Right, we need to get this person pinged. <clears throat> really? I couldn't see them? That's surprisingly annoying. Haha! -ha, got you. Stealth kill. Two times damage. It's not actually, by the way. It is in my mind. It's not actually. There we go. Spotted you just before you died. Wow, the enemy team have already lost five people. We've lost one. But I actually don't see where the fights are happening on the map because no one is pinging. I am being starved of information. Is anyone down there? I'm guessing they must be. Either that or the people who've charged forward towards the enemy base have been mopping up an unprepared team. Could well be. These early ranks got a lot of new players. Ooh, we've got someone on radar. Hello there. SMG Walker spotted. Try and take out your guns, shall we? Guns are what I want. I don't want the legs because they're shielded. Guns are what I would like to take away. Nope, it looks like you might win this one. Try and stick in the air. Yes, my teammates! Thank you! You saved me! Ah, oh, well done. That was that was going badly. My typing is terrible, my hands are extremely cold. Feels like I'm trying to type with my hands in jelly. Far too much resistance to the movement of my knuckles. Let's see, where is that last person? I have no radar, but my bot is surprisingly capable of hopping along. Thank you very much for the uh, pings there though. But at this point, there's nothing I can do. I can maybe hop my way to the base in time. 
I would actually like it if they added some sort of physics to the legs, so it you just toppled over. Although that would make a lot of the bots that I make not as good anymore. It would still be funny. I got one kill, one assist. Not very good damage here, but you know, not too bad in terms of store, score. Still third place. So I'm, I'm happy with that. I think we probably have enough time to uh, do one more battle, especially if I time lapse building the bot. It will mean that some of the the <laughs> speaking speaking for myself here funny comments I made whilst building it will be lost. But I suspect being able to fit in one extra battle will be will be uh, worth it. We got the Mega Leg Mark II and the Electro Plates. And the Caterpillar Tracks at Mark II. Fantastic. We've got a little bit of extra space on our bot as well. Let's go have a look. How much do these cost? Cost 24. We could fit two if I get rid of something else. Okay. I like. Let's drop that down. We'll get rid of the top gun. Um, let's build that out, actually. Hmm. That's not too bad, I suppose. If I place this there, move these around. I would like to try and get a shield on this. I could either have the shields there, or the shields there. I actually prefer having the shields like that. Ah, oh, really? Just shy. Just shy. It means... Well, these are no longer useful, anyway, because uh, I can't actually see... Uh, shine the light through my shields. So... In a way, that actually does work out fairly well. These lights are so, so CPU heavy. It's kind of silly how much you, you pay for having lights on your bot. And yet, I still want them. So who's the fool, really? <laughs> I think it's me. Okay, let's uh, grab some more shielding. Now we could place these here. Bit of extra protection for those guns, and then we add those guns on top, perhaps? Dread. Afraid you're gonna have to go as well. Okay, so we've, we've lost all of our lights. I'm a little bit sad. Tiny little bit, bit sad, but we've got six guns and a fair bit of electro uh, plating there. So the front of our bot is now fairly, uh, significantly more protected than it used to be. So let's have one more battle with this new bot. And we'll see how things go. Hopefully, it doesn't take us too long to get in. Well, there have been some wonky things going on with the uh, Robocraft servers the last couple of days. But uh, it seems to be fairly stable at the moment. I have tried to record once before and I just threw the recording out. Because <laughs> it, was, it was just me waiting and not getting into fights. Okay, let's see. Good luck, have fun all. This map looks about as cold as I feel. Wonderful. The battle for Gleas Lake has begun. Hello there, many guns. More of our allies joining. We've got some flyers. Very nice. And let's see, where are the most of our allies going? We're gonna be moving in this direction, it seems. The back of this bot looks so Ugh. I need to I need to smarten that up. I need another color to add to the palette. I think using the brown and green will work well. Once I can. Your bot looks nice, though. All right, let's uh, try and catch up with our allies. Ooh, where was that enemy there? There was one on my radar just a moment ago. He's coming around behind. Yes, okay. I'm going to try and circle back and catch them. And away, so they'll never stealth kill. Maybe. Okay, there's a couple more. Where on earth are you? You're over there. I see you not. I'm currently looking at two, but I only see... Oh, I see you up there. I think not, Plasma Drone. You've been trying to hunt me down for a little while, and I take great offense at that. Get down. I looked up a couple of times, but I wasn't expecting anything to be that high. Ah, sneak attack. Go for the guns. Hello. I have frightened you, you've gone into a wild spin, and now you are dead, or will be soon. Hello! There we go, fantastic! Stealth kills! I'm gonna have to rename you the Rogue. 
In fact, that's a damn good idea. Okay, the enemy team have lost a lot, but so have we. There is someone on our base right now. Let's go for a couple of shots. Long range. My shields should put me in a good position for dealing with you. Okay, you're not enjoying that. You're moving off. Good. Why are our allies not responding is the question here. Still got my radar, which is good. Ooh, okay. I see you. Let's get you spotted. Try and do some damage there. Not enough. You are low on health, but oh, there's a lot of enemies here. Try and take your allies out of this before they become an issue for me. Try and do a little bit more. Okay, the whole enemy team is here to say hello to me. Not good. Use them as cover from the greatest damage dealers they've got. Nope, that's not working. I've lost one of my legs. Best I can do is take someone out with me. Come on. No, I've lost my guns. Come on. Just need one or two. Ha! Got you. Flee. Go forth, my allies. Take their base. I may have bought you a little bit of time, but I don't think it will have been enough. Oh, I like your ditty little mech. That mech looks awesome. Very much like it. How are my allies doing? Oh, they're just kind of dotted around, not doing much. They're going to need more people on, on this to cap it in time. Oh, dear. Come on, you can do it. Just try and drive those wheels. We've got a significant head start, but it's, I'm, they're catching. They can't. No! No, what have you done? You fool! <laughs> you were overcome by wanting to dance around and play. You may have just thrown the mesh. Oh, well. I can, I can understand. I mean, I am oft times possessed of a desperate need to dance as well. It's No, I think the enemy is just going to catch it. If you hadn't have drifted off, we would have won. But uh, good game there. Very, oh, gee. Good game, everyone. I enjoy that all the same. Quite a lot of damage for my team. Uh, one of the only people on our team to be in the upper ranks. We had some fairly good damage dealers. Um, only one other person got two kills, but a couple of people got two assists. A nice, a nice match all together. A team with a lot of assists means that they moved as a group, which is generally going to be a better option. But I think with that, we're going to be wrapping up this episode. In the next, I will either return to the hoplite or I will continue work on the rogue. I'm thinking I'm liking the idea of uh, kind of now that we've we've kind of given this this little bot a bit of a character actually building to that character and trying to make a bit more of a stealthy bot both in uh, actual function and simply aesthetic so before we do anything else let us go ahead and go to select robot we're going to rename this the rogue there we go and that is going to be it for now. So I hope you've enjoyed and will be joining me for the next, which will hopefully not be nearly as far in the future as this one was from the last episode. But until then, and as always, do take care.